Welcome to the YouTube Dating Game Show. I'm your host, Gary 20 Last time, we left off with two odd couples we hooked up, named Grip and a lovely young woman by the name of Roxy Dukecox. Anyways, let's see how that date went. What kind of date you see him grip on? What kind of date you see me on? I tell you, I was petrified. Grip was petrified for sure. I'm telling you, this girl, she lives in California. What Grip tells you, that's where all the fruits and nuts are from. Yes, that's the truth. That's where they come from. And she is in with all of them. She is a fruit and a nut, that's for sure. What the hell did you send me on, Gary? You sent me in, you sent me in the, in the locks of hell. That's right. The date, the date looked pretty good. I mean, it was, not what I expected it, but he he didn't shower or anything for our date. When I first met him, he went up to me and grabbed my boobs. And then I'm like, what the fuck? I mean, he said they were real, but like, they're not even fake, you know? I mean, I wish I had fake boobs. I'll tell you how this date went, Gary. First of all, I went to her house. Yep, I did. I went to her house. And she opened the door, and she let me in. And I go over to the couch, and I sit down, and I'm, you know, doing my thing. And she, she sits next to me, and I try, you know, Grip, Grip likes titties. Grip loves titties. So Grip started to feel on her titties. And I swear to God, them titties ain't real. Them titties feel like rubber. That's right. They feel like rubber. Them ain't real titties. I kind of figured they weren't real. But you know, I was, I was, Rick was kind of going with the flow because, you know, Rick didn't know what was up. So anyways, you know, I take my hand and I put it on her leg. Because, you know, Grip was kind of getting a little romantic. Because, you know, it's been a while for Grip. It's been a while since Grip has had a belly. So anyways, Grip puts his hand on her leg. And Grip feels something hard. And I ask her, I said, what the hell is that? Mm. And you know what she tells me? She said, that is my shake flashlight. And I'm like, what the fuck is a flashlight? I said, why you got a flashlight in your pants? And she told me, she said, shake it. Shake my flashlight and it'll work. I said, I ain't touching that flashlight. I said, Rick, Rick don't want nothing with that flashlight. I said, what are you? I said, are you a transvestite? She said, no, I ain't no transvestite. I said, well, I think you's a transvestite because you got something hard in your pants. And Grip don't want nothing to do with any of that kind of shit. That's for sure. Grip likes titties and Grip loves fish. <laughs> Grip ain't after no shakeable flashlights. That's right. Grip don't want no flashlights. I always carry a flashlight in my pocket because I believe that vampires are always going to attack me and I, I really like that movie Twilight so you know I carry a, a, a flashlight but yeah Grip touched me down there and it was just like it was just fucking weird because he thought it was a penis <laughs> but it wasn't. 
uh, he touched my flashlight. She kind of did seem strange to grip. You know, she had one big eyebrow going across her head. That right there was a, a sign that things wasn't going to go right. That's right. It wasn't going to go right. Grip was just like frozen after he saw that. Grip was frozen. I got up, I was so scared, Gary. I was scared, she was. Well, you know, he was kind of a slob. When we ate, he ate my food too. And I was still kind of hungry at, at the end of the day because he ate all my food. And I, I don't think he's attractive at all. I mean, look at me, I'm beautiful and sexy. I deserve the best, of course. And he wasn't sexy at all, but something about him, it was just like, he, I just fell in love. And he, he's fucking, he's awesome, you know? But I don't know, so I chased him around the table. He was playing hard to get, but I, he, he liked it. <laughs> I got up and she started chasing my ass around the couch. She tackled me down like a big silver back gorilla and had me pinned on the floor. Could, could not get away. I had to turn around and give her a, I had to give her a good lock to the jaw. That's right, in order to get away from her. Look at me, I'm still shaking. I'm still shaking, Gary. I'm still shaking. Gary, what the hell are you doing? What the hell are you doing, old grip? Sending me on these wild, wild ass dates. I don't get it. If you, you know, Gary, if you want to send old grip on another date, you're going to have to let him see a picture of her first. Because I'm telling you, this was not no girl. This was not no fella. This was a fella. That's right. It was a fella. And, and, and Grit was scared shitless. He was. Grit was scared shitless. Don't send me on no dates like that again. That's right. I could tell. I could tell. She was hairier than a motherfucking ape. That's right. That's right. Grip is shaking. Just shaking, Grip. Shaking like a leaf. I'm so glad I got my ass up out of there. That's right. Okay, Gary. Bye now. Sexy girl right here put his moves on him. I went, Arr. I tried to kiss him, and when I kissed people, I gave him my Roxy Douchecock kiss. <laughs> would I go out with Grip again? Uh, yeah, I would totally go out with Grip again. <laughs> well, this is it for now. And until next time, I'm your host, Gary 20 and see you later.